In this video we're going to cut a hole in a cast iron soil stack. This is so that we can connect a waste pipe into the soil stack using a mechanical boss. I will cover that in a later video. To cut the hole in the soil stack we're going to use this quality hole saw which is a starette and that is a 57mm one or a two and a quarter inch. To use this you will need a arbor that simply screws in there like so. Then you simply push that part forwards. We can then fit that into the cordless drill. I'm just going to remove the old saw until we get through with the actual pilot drill. That way, if we're pressing on hard, the teeth aren't actually going to slam into the cast iron drain pipe. Ideally you would use a mains powered drill for doing this but I'm actually just going to use this cordless drill and I'm really going to take my time with it and do it really slowly. You do need a very powerful drill for a hole saw of this size. And then put plenty of coolant on. And then we can proceed to cut the hole. Technically when you're drilling cast iron it doesn't actually need any lubrication because it is actually self lubricating due to the carbon in the cast iron. But in order to get the maximum amount of life out of the hole saw it is a good idea to use some coolant or some lubricant. An important point when you're buying a hole saw for doing this job is not to get one with an ejector spring on like that. If you get one with an ejector spring like that, as soon as you get through the cast iron soil pipe, it's actually going to spit the piece out and that will go down the drain. So it's absolutely critical that you don't get a hole saw with an ejector spring like that. If you have one of those, you can always remove the spring and use it that way but never use it with the ejector spring on because that could end up blocking the drain. I hope you found this video useful. If you have and you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel.